Good morning, Spanish River. Today is February 10. Now into the pledge and a moment of silence and the desk with Mina and Abby. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. What's up, Spanish River? It's Ethan Schwartz with a Me and Sam tribute rap. Cue it. Yeah, me and Sam always the flyest in the room, undebatably the best Mr. and Miss at any high school locally. Hopefully I can be like them soon. For now I'm just gonna make them feel cool. Get on the announcement, spit on this tune. You know how much you love them, wish I could buy them an apartment, wish I could buy all their favorite items in abundance. You know when I'm talking, my love for me and Sam always be the topic of discussion. But it's nothing if I can't give them love in public, so all the other stuff is rubbish. I just want to show them some love with this sick mix. Find Sam in the hall, give him a big kiss. That's the way it goes when you love them as much as I do. Just trying to show my love for Spanish River High School. Hi, I'm Abby Leeds. And I'm Mina Toomey, and Abby's going to start us off. Girls Flag Football Tryouts will be this Monday, February 14th, 3.30 to 6 p.m. on the practice field located behind the theater. You must have a completed athletic packet and cleats to try out. For more information, please contact Coach Drew at riverflagfootball at gmail.com. No flag football experience is required. See you there. Do you need math help? Come get free tutoring during lunch by members of the math club. Room 8115 during first lunch and portable 8 during second lunch every Tuesday and Thursday. Now back to Michael Barone with Grad Bash details, followed by Candy Grams and Pie and AP. Seniors, get to the table today for Grad Bash bus signups in front of the Shark Shop and Biotech buildings. All of your paperwork, field trip permission slip, Grad Bash pledge, and COVID release must be completely filled out and signed by you and your parents in order to sign up for a bus. To ride on the same bus as your friends, you need to sign up at the same time. If you do not have first lunch, your first lunch friend can turn in your paperwork. Also, we are continuing to monitor your obligations. If you have not paid your obligations, you will be removed from the bus and, your, and the trip until your obligations are paid. Even a $5 ID obligation needs to be taken care of. Hey Sharks, this week Spanish River SGA is hosting Pi and AP in the courtyard. The money that is raised will be donated to Speak Up for Kids Palm Beach County, a nonprofit organization. Each day until Thursday, you can donate any amount of money to select an AP to be pied, and on Friday, whatever AP has the most money donated to them will get pied in the face during both lunches. The current scores are Mr. Wade has $30, Ms. Castellano has $2, Ms. Carrill has $2, and Coach Mack has $1. So make sure you guys get your donations in and look out for the event during Friday during both lunches. Attention seniors, do you have 500 hours of community service? If so, you can receive a cord to wear at graduation. Please turn your hours into the main office by Tuesday, March 1st, in order to qualify. No Limits Virtual HBCU College Fair is happening all week starting at 4 p.m. Representatives from more than 20 schools will be available for individual sessions. For more information, visit palmbeachschools.org slash HBCU. 
Don't forget National Honor Society tutors daily during both lunches. First lunch, Blue Lunch, Media Center. Second lunch, Silver Lunch, room 1153D. Please take advantage of this free resource provided by National Honor Society students. We are here to help. Now back to Abby. Here's the counselor's tip of the week. Make sure you communicate with your teachers. You should ask questions, accept feedback, and give feedback when your teacher asks for it. Teachers appreciate it when they see that students try. February celebrates CTE month. Today, we're highlighting the Early Childhood Academy and then on to Ms. Castellano. This little light of mine I'm gonna let it shine This little light of mine I'm gonna let it shine This little light of mine I'm gonna let it shine Let it shine Let it shine Let it shine So the Early Childhood Academy is a great academy that we have on campus. It provides us to have hands-on experience with the kids and help them with whatever they need and to always be there for them. And we love it. It's always fun. And, and Definitely my favorite experience at Spanish River, my favorite program. I love this academy. Definitely got me close to what I want to do in life. Definitely want to be a teacher, be around children all the time. I love all the little ones, especially little and junior sharks. They're definitely the best day. And it's more than just like learning about the kids or what it is. It's a connection and a bond that we build with them and it's amazing. Definitely yeah. best experience. Uh, this academy has helped me learn how to not only help children academically but also help them socially with their um, friends and learning how to interact with older people. The cool thing about this academy that I really like is that once you finish you can become a preschool teacher yourself. So uh, I want to be a pediatrician when I grow up and I think that this is a great way to really learn about how children grow, how they develop mentally and physically. It's really amazing. Good morning, Sharks. Miss Castellano here. Hope everyone's having a great morning. I wanted to come on and remind those of you that unfortunately forgot your computers yesterday to make sure you bring those uh, school district devices back on campus prior to testing because they receive important updates and you don't want to be locked out of testing or waiting for your computer to update the day that you are testing. I know that last year you were able to kind of forget your computer and we had extras. We don't have extras this year because now we are one to one and we've given all those devices out. So we have a couple if someone's computer breaks during testing but we do not have extras to give you when we start testing. So please make sure you bring your device on campus, you let it get its uploads properly so that we can test you in the spring and that you can do your absolute best. I want to say congratulations to our boys and girls soccer teams for great seasons. They had tough losses in the last couple minutes of their regional play matches, but I'm super proud of them for their hard fight the entire season and tonight we wish our girls basketball team all the best as they move into regional play come out and support your sharks tonight and keep working hard sharks you're doing a great job you're getting back in the groove of things paying attention we're working on getting to class on time but the engagement is much better I'm seeing much and much less headphones so let's keep up that work so that we can make sure um, that we end the year on a very positive note all right have a great day sharks Good morning, Spanish River. Hope everybody had a good Wednesday. I had a very frustrating Wednesday. Unfortunately, the boys soccer team went up to um, Palm Beach Central last night, played a great game, gave up a goal in the last minute to lose one nothing. But it was a very well-played game, and the guys really showed the great true shark spirit in their battle to the end. Um, so congratulations to the boys. I know you're all frustrated. 
and, but we thank you for your hard efforts and work during the year. But after frustration becomes elation. And what we're doing today, we want to first of all wish the boys and girls tennis team the best of luck. They open the spring sports season this afternoon, 3 o'clock. They're hosting West Boca, so we wish them the best of luck. And I'm really excited about tonight's basketball game in the gym. Our girls' varsity basketball game is hosting Wellington in the first round of the regional playoffs. So if you get a chance, please come out. Tip-offs at 7 o'clock. I know Coach, Mc Coach McKay and all the girls would love all the support they could get. So, again, always do well. Have a great day. Be smart. Be make good choices and be a great shark and wear your badge. Hi, River. I'm Connor Lee. I'm Andrew Davis, and we're two of your River captains this year for Boys Lacrosse. Our first game is February 15th at 5 p.m. We'd really like you to come out. We're white. We're looking forward to having a good season this year and hopefully win a district title. We'd appreciate the support. That's all we have for today, Spanish River. Have a great rest of your day. Stay gay.